Hey y'all. It's Random Rips. Check it out. We got some stuff to open. Lots of stuff. Be right back. Well, here it is, another dang Monday. But I did manage to dig some stuff up. I got a couple things in the mail. That'll brighten up any Monday. Let's see, thank you for your order. Oh, nice brand new team bag. They do all this for a one dollar card that I needed. For someone that needs it for a set. Oh no, this is the Bo Jackson. Nice. Let's see what I paid for that. Two dollars and ninety-four cent. Eighty-six Bo Jackson highlights. Donruss, one of the ones I did not have from his rookie year. <coughs> so technically, it's it's a rookie card, kind of. Right. Eighty-six is rookie year. Well, add that to the bow collection. Let's see, this one's going to take some scissors to get into. They taped it up pretty well. Alrighty then. Okay, oh my. Hey, they sent us some literature. Ain't that nice. Louis Keel. Yeah, a friend of mine needed that for a set, so I hooked him up, and I'm not sure what this is. This might be those, uh, there's still a couple of cards I think I need, no, no, I finished that, what am I thinking? I'm not sure here. Uh... Oh, it's the three cards I need for the Series 1 Stars of MLB Tops. Since Series 2 is out in a couple days, I wanted to go ahead and get the ones I needed. I thought I need. oh no, that's right, it was just two, Franco and Chisholm. So, got that set done. Start work on number set 2, Series 2. Well, that was a productive mail day. Save those wrappers. And let's see, we got new stuff to open. Heritage. But let's start with last year's Donruss. I had some uh, CVS Care Pass money on my card. So I ended up only having to pay $2, less than $2 for this pack. I would not recommend buying cards at CVS in Georgia. They charge $12.99 for, for this fat pack that I just opened, which is why I never buy there unless I have coupons and bonus cash built up from prescriptions, in which case I can get a pack for two bucks. I'll do that. This is a good set. Looks like it'll be the last Panini set with uh, current players. Unless uh, Fanatics actually buys Panini, which I'm sorry, but I don't see that happening. I'm afraid the antitrust people would step in if they did that, tried to do that. Will not let that happen, even though they're not exactly competition. There's the nickname Mike Trout. Hey, O'Neill Cruz rookie. That's probably the uh, best card in the set. Base cards. Set that one off to the side. We got a Riley Adams. Carlos Stanton. Max Freed. Tim Anderson. Some good players. 
Ramuto, Wilson Contreras, and hey, we got an Independence Day insert. Sweet. Speaking of Ramuto, it's funny how they always seem to come in the same pack. You got the insert, you also get the base card. But yeah, this should be numbered, I do believe. Huh. Oh, I thought they were numbered. It's the Independence Day uh, border. Hmm. Guess it's just a variation, no numbered. Tiasca Hernandez in the red foil. Luis Garcia. Oh, we got something else back here, too. A Babe Ruth red foil. That's cool. What is this? Ah, the hit list, Brian Reynolds, Mojo Style Refractor, I guess it's not a Mojo, this is Panini, huh, you yeah, know, for two bucks it wasn't a bad pack, for twelve ninety nine, it would have been awful, I don't know, I have to see what that Romuto goes for, the O'Neill Cruz is a couple of bucks, uh, being Brian Reynolds, I doubt the hit list is worn a buck or two. The Bay Bruce might bring a few dollars. All right, well, let's get on with it. We got Heritage, we got Donruss Baseball, and Contenders Football. So, let's go to the football ones now. <clears throat> Since this is uh, 2022, even though it's brand new on the market, well, came out, what, maybe a month ago at most. I still need a couple of dozen cards for a 100-card set, so maybe I can get a couple. Christian McCaffrey, Herbert, C.D. Lamb, Mondre Stevenson. We got a legendary Jim Kelly. Got to be Jim Kelly, a green parallel, and a winning ticket of Travis Kelsey. That's cool how it looks like it's a scratched off lottery ticket. These are more of those four dollar retail packs from from uh, Five Below. Got an Aaron Rodgers there coming up on the back. And Jerry Judy, Zach Wilson, Cam Akers, Shad Bateman. Let's see if they just had some rookies in here. Two all. And Aaron Rodgers. Well, at least we got a couple of good names on the inserts. It's a nice looking card. Good picture of him. I still ain't wild about contenders because that base set has all that negative space where they make it look like a ticket. All right, let's see how many hits we can get out of two more packs of Donner Space Ball. I've opened two packs so far and I've gotten three numbered cards. It's just crazy, these things are loaded. Say that, watch me get nothing. I, I, really, I like the design. It's a big change from last year's. Past few years have all looked so similar I can't tell them apart. But this, this is new. Some of these old vets out of the way. And we got Pedro Martinez. Wow. Locked and loaded. I guess that's the new pitcher insert. So, oh, look. Like I said, 809 of 999. Another serial numbered card. And then we got Colson Montgomery with the Blue Stars border. And that, I guess that's part, that's just a parallel. Steve Carlton. About that. Foil, blue foil Steve Carlton. And we got some prospects. Mice and Wynn. We've got a couple of his. And uh, Gavin Stone gonna see a lot of prospects in here that you've never heard of oh those were uh that was fun oh I guess I don't want to put it with the uh
<laughs> and stacked it with last year's. <laughs> there we go. Get them mixed up. Let's put these back here so that don't happen. And another pack. Let's see if we can get another numbered card or how about an autograph? I'd love to get a Nolan Ryan or something. Duke Snyder would be great. There's the Duke. What is uh, going on back there behind him? Oh, okay. It's just the palm trees. I thought that guy's head was blowing up or something. I'm like, what the heck's in the background? All right, Joe Morgan. Larry Walker. Johnny Bench. Oh, man. We got one of them fake out cards. Great. Cal Ripken Diamond King. Oh. I'll check that out. I don't know what that is. Fire! 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 But it's numbered 27 out of 75. I can get the glare of the light off of it. I can get some focus in this camera. Come on. Guys. Huh. Guess I need a better camera. There you go. 27 out of 75, Cal Ripken Diamond King. I like it. And the Carson Williams Blue Border Foil. And another Prost Jacob Berry. And hey, I like Eddie Matthews. It's one of my vintage PC players. Being a brave, you know, he's one of the one of the classics. Well, that was cool. I and mean, that's fun. I've got to get a. Uh, I'm gonna have to get some blasters of those or something. Well, it's time. Let's see if the hangers are bangers for the Heritage 2023. I hear that they are for Series Two, coming later this week. I do believe I'm gonna try to get a hobby box of that. Same as I did for the Series 1s. It gives me a nice head start on getting my set finished. And there's always some nice stuff in Hobby. They do have some exclusive parallels in the retail ones to make it worth buying. The Fat Packs are what I've heard is the best thing to get from the new Top Series 2. So I'll certainly be uh, picking some of those up. Let's see what we got here. All right, Kyle Schwarber, Tony Kemp. We're gonna go through these pretty quick. Glenn Otto, Cronenworth. Guthrie, Shapen, Ezekiel Duran, hey, nice one of Freddie Freeman, I still wish he had a Braves cap on, just don't look right with that LA up there, Luis Ortiz, Julio Urias, Eloy Jimenez, we got an all-star card, Looks like Mookie Betts and Byron Buxton, the same one I got a couple days ago. <laughs> and Vaughn Grissom, which I also got a couple days ago, but I do not mind getting a spare Vaughn Grissom. I do you believe uh, I like that? <clears throat> Yandy Diaz? Okay, thought we might have a run of sideways ones like you do in Stadium Club. <laughs> this is Heritage Day, so probably not. Jose Ramirez, I like that dude, great ball player. Josh Naylor. Tosker Hernandez. Will Brennan. Our insert, new age performers, Julio Rodriguez. It's not exactly a rookie anymore though, guys. Christian Pachi. Lawler, Calhoun, Libertore. Joey Bart, Jeremiah Estrada, Morjan, and Shohei Otani. And did they leave the 
Los Angeles off on purpose or huh I guess so if we got any of the varieties Oh, I don't see any. Supposedly, it's right there by the Tops logo in the corner. I don't know. I haven't seen one yet, so I wouldn't be sure, but that's what I heard. Well, guys, hope you enjoyed it. 15 minutes is a good long time. I'm going to see if I got any closer to some sets. I've got some sorting to do. i got a lot of stuff to do. Like, subscribe, uh, do that other stuff, and, and go on my eBay and buy something. Later, guys.